Who's that woman on your computer? That's my wife. My very beautiful wife. Who also happens to be a superhero. Huh. Oops, I didn't mean for you. To see my magic. It's okay, Paul. Really? Thank goodness. Those powers were given to me by my wife. Victoria forbidden me to use it. And almost broke Vicky and I up. I'm sorry, Paul. I have bad news, Paul. The CEO is rehiring Victoria. Great! When is she coming back? Monday. But don't worry. Victoria was demoted to weekend news anchor. Thank goodness. Because she doesn't deserve to be my news manager. I hate to bother you, Vicky. But can you take over that table over there? Those girls are really giving me a hard time. Oh. Okay, Naomi. I'll deal with them. Are you here to see Paul Jones? Yes, I am actually. Me too. I just want to meet him. I want to do more than, than just meet him. I want to drive him a big hatch kiss. Are you guys ready to order? Or are you going to be rude to me too? Why do you keep butering us? Right. Because you were here for 45 minutes, and you both ordered nothing. Can you just go away? We'll call you when we need you. Good. I'm not coming back. What's wrong? Those females sitting at the table. They won't order anything. I take care of them. It's almost time for you to punch out anyway. Thanks, boss. Look, Cookie. There's Paul Jones now. Boy, it's yeah. What? This is seriously not happening. Hey ladies? It sucks that I'm stuck in the back, being the cook, because I miss out on seeing cute chicks like you guys. Just get out of our faces. Wow. That's harsh. So honey, shall we go? You don't have to ask me twice. What's up honey? I was looking at our house. We lived there for a very long time. I bought that house when Plotagonia Gardens was being developed. I wanted to find someone special to share it with. This is my house. Don't worry Vic, Hunk isn't going to hurt you again. He doesn't even know where I live. What if he finds out? Don't worry. He won't, and if he doesn't, he'll be answering to me again. Alright, Paul. Come on. Let me show you around. This is the guest bedroom. I'm sorry it's a little messy right now. It's okay, Paul. Really? Really? I'm not high maintenance. Messes don't bother me. For you. Thank goodness. And this, right here, is my bed. It's really nice. But I think... I better get my stuff unpacked. I'll be in the guest room. Hold up, Vic. You're staying here with me. Us? In your room? In the same bed together? Why not, Vicky? Nothing's going to happen. I promise. And I'm not going to ever hurt you. You have to please trust me. I do trust you, Paul. It's just that no guy was ever nice to me, except you. Well, I'm the first. I do have one request. Could I sleep on the side, away from the window? I'm afraid Hunk's going to find me. Of course, Vic. I'm never going to let you go.
I'll put your stuff away in a bit. For now, let's go back downstairs. Okay. It's going to be okay, honey. I have a question. What about your girlfriend, Lucy? To tell you the truth, Vic, I broke up with Lucy two months ago. So, you're currently single? Yes. Paul? I have a confession? I have one too, Vic. Let me go first, Vicky, since you rescued me as the Blazing Beauty, and you came in the cafe for that autograph. I never stopped thinking about you. You're the most beautiful and down-to-earth woman I ever met, and we may come from different worlds. And I know we just met. I don't just like you. I love you! I love you too. When growing up, I had a huge crush on you. That's amazing. So we do have things in common. Oh no. It's Hunk. Stay here. I'll check it out. What? What are you doing, Builder? I broke my beer bottle. Look, Builder. I have a special guest at my house. That went through a lot of trauma. So, stop with your drunk behavior. Okay. Okay, Paul. Whatever. Is everything okay, Paul? Everything is fine. Just my one neighbor. Thank goodness. Vicky. I'm not going to let anything happen to you. I love you very much. I love you very much too. I remember years ago. I remember too. And years later, I made the right choice. Hmm. I love you! I love you too.